It's the crew with ish hard enough to cook the kitchen. I get other rappers I hook to bitch. Shit, I'ma catch a fish with this one, though the hook is missing. I just took your pigeons. Yeah, I'm flying out. This is not in the name of love. Consider stepping out. But I'm here to prove that even you can cash it out. So imagine the holy sis dude like no need bank account. Well, you ain't cooler. You need a ghostwriter, but I think cash will cool ya. You a player. Before Cresta started out with Bell Rapping to be known as the king of African rap and also collaborating with international acts such as Rick Ross, Rich Homie Kwan, Wale and more. He started his career back in 2003 and this is what we'll be talking about in today's video. I'll be giving guys the before the fame of Senzo, Brika Villagazi, professional known as Cresta. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and make sure that you subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this man. As I have new videos coming every single week, please do subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this every single week man. Cresta was born on 11th of August 1988 in Katlehong, which is the largest township in Gauteng province of South Africa. He was formerly raised by his mother and he attended Komolani Secondary School in Katlehong, but he later moved to Alafang High School. But when he was 16 years old, he dropped out of high school so that he can be able to chase his dream as a rapper. During his high school life, Costa developed an interest in poetry, and he got so much positive feedback and encouragement from his fellow students and teachers as well. An assignment, you know, to fix a speech or do an unprepared speech. Well, an unprepared, I couldn't help them yeah, with the unprepared, course. right? Uh, but the prepared speech and everything like that, I'd be the guy everyone came to because of how I wrote, you know. Mm. And, and also my English teacher didn't help that much because um, she kind of really liked what I wrote and told the class and made like some of whatever it is that I wrote um, an example of how you, in the you know, how you construct a speech, sure. you know, in the classroom. So um, the guys that didn't want to write the speech came to me. I should have sold them actually now that I think about <laughs> it. He was also involved in a music group called the Ghetto Fellas, although the group broke up, but Cresta continued with finding his breakthrough in the music industry. Cresta also took part in competitions and events to make his name visible before he could be known as the king of African rap. As a teenager, Cresta convinced his mother to give him taxi fare so he can get to Butabing Entertainment's offices, which resulted in him being added to Butabing Entertainment's roster. The label was found by Sugar Max and Slick. After Cuesta was added on the Butabing Entertainment roster, he earned the judging gig on the Sprite Hip Hop Tour in 2007. And he also earned a feature on the ventilation street tape. Hey, not from the west, but man figang and zakanye. When I jang nigi pen and manning velen keep it plain. Put a million in the freezer, then you biza chili m. Young repelli malutini vele fed. Y'all couldn't make a big killing if you murdered take a leak. And you could see us, man jang and zapella. Ask your Valentine's present, girl. I'm the best rapper ever. In 2010, Costa released his first album Special Request, followed by his first installation of Dakar in 2013. And he went on with Dakar 2 in 2016. And Dakar 3 was announced that it will be dropped very soon. In 2010, Cuesta also performed during the national roadshow held before the FIFA 2010 World Cup in South Africa. He also worked with Kelly Rowland, Josie, Two-Face on the Everywhere You Go Anthem for MTN and also got a chance to perform during the 2010 FIFA World Cup closing ceremony. Regarding Cuesta's love life, the rapper is married to Yolanda Velase, which is the lady he has been with years before he became one of the well-known rappers in South Africa. The couple have one daughter together and recently Cuesta announced that they are expecting their second daughter very soon. If you know what Cuesta did when Spirit with Wale, you really know that he's one of the biggest African rappers that we have ever had in this history. If you want to see more videos like this, please do subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this, man. As I'll be dropping new videos every single week, please do subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this every single week, man. Also, do not forget to visit my blog to read all the news and updates about music and entertainment. I'll leave all the links in the description below, man. See you guys on the next one. Peace.